Every week, News Channel 8 highlights people and organizations in our community who are working to do good and pay it forward, sponsored by FH Fur. For any parent, losing a child brings a pain that almost never dulls. Whitney Wilde shows us how one Prince George's County woman is recovering after losing her son by paying it forward. Sometimes a little larger, a little smaller, depending on the person or the event. Margaret Jackson knows it doesn't take much to make someone smile. Just a simple box that we give. Small things make a big difference. Well, the more you help someone else, the more you're helping yourself. She's held on to that notion tightly, a way to ease the heartache after tragedy ripped her family apart. Life was good, things were going well, I had this fabulous son, and then out of the blue, completely out of the blue, all of that was taken away from me when I got the news that he had been killed in an accident. A horrific car crash took her only child, Richard, who went by RJ. Um, clearly, I was devastated. I kind of lost it for a while. The hurt was unbearable, but she says it was the memory of RJ's sparkling smile that brightened her darkest hour. That grin inspired a new venture in his honor, appropriately called RJ Smiles. You got everything? In addition to her job as a consultant, every so often, oh, they fit perfectly. Margaret takes a package of goodies like these to someone in need. We caught up with her on her way to a homeless shelter for women in the district. Hi, it's RJ Smiles. You can't box happiness and you can't always erase pain, but Margaret is making it her mission to do both. I think the ladies are going to love these. To bring an awareness to the fact that. Pay It Forward sponsor FH Fur will donate $500 to RJ Smiles for their work, bringing happiness to those who need it most. If you'd like to nominate someone for our Pay It Forward, please send us an email to News Channel 8. We'll bring that up for you. Send an email to payitforward at news8.net, and we'll be right back.